Rain pounded most of Marin County today, and that was hard on many people as they were still trying to dry out from last week's deluge. You're taking a look at some of the rain when it was coming. Look at that. It's really coming down. This was uh, in the afternoon in Marin. And Crown Force Teresa Stasio joins us from San Rafael tonight to let us know how things are going. Teresa. Well, hi there, Pam and Ken. Well, here in San Rafael, certainly having all this rain is helpful for the drought, to beat the drought. However, there are a lot of people here that are still dealing with all of the foul out from what happened with that storm just a week ago. Monday's downpour dropping a lot of water on Marin County streets and again filling up already swollen creeks. In San Rafael, this was a scene just a week ago. Cars trapped in water, trees down when that giant storm swept in. The bottom of the door was blown out? Yeah, that was wood. Hmm. And the water level got that high? Ross says his office hit hard and he is still dealing with the damage flood waters caused. I did receive a call from someone in the neighbor who I didn't, neighborhood who I didn't know who uh, thought there was water coming into my office. It wasn't until Tuesday morning when I actually got back uh, from Chicago uh, Monday night, Tuesday I was able to get to the office that I realized that six inches of water had um, intruded into my office. Yeah, so it took, it's taken me a week uh, to uh, clean up and put everything back and hopefully get the moisture. Uh, a carpet uh, remediation company is helping me. At this point he says he can't suck any more water out. When he first came in and did the remediation, he took out 50 gallons of water. And this is a concrete slab with a very thin carpet on top of it. So there was a lot of water that he got out. And Ross says he runs the fans when he isn't working. It's just too loud to keep them going then. He says all of this, a pain. I'm not happy. I, I don't think that this was, I think this could have been prevented. I made a phone call um, to the uh, San Rafael uh, Public Works and got someone live. And their response to me was that, uh, they had not um, uh, expected that in this time of year that they needed to get out and clean the drains. I followed up and called the city manager as well as the public works department here in San Rafael to find out if they're going to take any kind of financial responsibility for what he faced and other residents I talked with here in the area, but they didn't get back to us. We, of course, know that all of this rain is very helpful for the drought. The reservoirs filling up here in Marin County, but as you heard, still a lot of people dealing with the aftermath of all of the flooding and all of the damage that it caused here in San Rafael. Teresa Stasio, back to you guys.